Yeah, these are some heavyweights, but we got Matty Bryan at about 6'2", 6 6'3", 6 at 220. His opponent, Castillo, only about 5'10", maybe 240. So these are big boys, but different body styles. Castillo's got a good stance. Gave up a single leg there. Gets taken down almost right a side, control. side. Very nice. Very nice. Especially with the 10th Planet guys, you don't want to mess with their guards. Yeah, I know Matty Briner personally, and I can tell you he is not a wrestler, but he has wrestling in his bloodline. Uh, a lot of his family members are, are state and, and decorated wrestlers. Very nice. Well, he showed some skills there. Very nice snap single right there. Tell you what, this is not good for Castillo. He wants to work out of this. There we go. He's got his guard now. Got hooks. Oh, easily passed. Easily passed. Very nice. Low hips. A lot of pressure. Looks like he's looking to set up a shoulder lock here. Matt Briner, an MMA fighter known for his striking. Good to see him out here at a grappling event. This is some of the best training for them. Opens up just one part of his game. Brenner's got his back now. What are we going to do here? Castillo's got a compact body. Might be hard to, to get in on him. Yeah, Briner very cautious and, and rightfully so. Briner's shutting him down over here, keeping him flat. Castillo looking for a deep half guard. Briner keeping really good pressure here. Really good posture. Castillo's got his posture pretty good right here. He's keeping he's, Briner on his toes. He's got Briner's leg in a little bit of danger here with 50 seconds left in the round. He's got his leg locked up on both ends. Very nice control of his posture. It's that, it's that electric chair we were talking about earlier. These guys from 10th Planet love that position. They love that move. They're really good with those leg attacks. Very sneaky, very successful with it. Oh, he's got... There we go. He attacks the arms and causes Castillo to give up a little bit of position right there. Very nice transition passing the guard there. Yeah, really cool when you can see a big guys move like they are. Absolutely. Castillo, very, very good from bottom there. End of that round. Nice. Here we go. Castillo looking willing to wrestle a little bit here from his feet. Defends a shot. Now he sits guard. Oh, nice pass. Nice pass. That's what you want to do with these guys. Pick their ankles up and pass. Slick maneuver here yeah. by Castillo to get out of that back positioning. Like you said, it's really interesting seeing the, the uh, bigger guys move so well on the ground. Right He's back got to kind that of half a, guard, though. Kind of like a quarter guard. He's got to move, though. He doesn't want to stay there. I like how Brenner's keeping heavy and looking for those submissions to help him pass. Oh, I think he has mount now. Worked right to mount. Castillo's tough to pass. Matt Briner being very yep. patient here. Now he's going to work around. He's got an armbar attempt possible here. Oh, yeah. Castillo's got short elbows. He's out. Very nice defense. Very nice defense. Very nice defense by Castillo. Brenner right back on him, though. Brenner's got good pressure from top. Castillo's so compact and he moves so well. Very hard to finish something on. Brenner's doing a really good job here. Yeah, hard to submit a bowling ball. Yeah. That's how this guy is shaped. He's... He's not giving up any limbs. He's, he's really compact, staying tight. Yeah, he's locking up for that electric chair again. He's looking to set it up. Nope, had a bail on that. Nice pass, right to mount. 
Very nice. And Brenner definitely took that one. Folks, big round of applause for Gordon Castillo for stepping up on short notice tonight, taking Joe's place when Joe can make it. First competition ever, and he's in front of 300 people. God bless you, man. Thank you very much. Your winner by decision, Matthew Big Red Rider!